That was a bad sound. Shit happens. Good morning. And uh, welcome to day two of this artist's life. Uh, I actually record this on the same day as I record day one because I had this tingling... Uh, is it inspiration maybe? It's powers, creativity and throughout my artistic practice I know that inspiration sometimes come but most often I need to work for it. I need to be disciplined. I need to dedicate time to create. Like, I just... Inspiration doesn't just come and just right after I recorded the first uh, instruction video I told you, remember, put one hour a day dedicated work and I was starting my hour of dedicated work and my practice is writing. I am a writer. I am a comedian, script writer, screenwriter, actor, artist. I write for the stage. I write to be read and to be heard, to be understood. That's why I created this 30-day journey to kind of connect and create a community because I miss a community where I can share my thoughts on being an artist, being creative, creating. Uh, because it's sometimes I am very alone. I'm very lonely. It's a lonely life having this mm, doubt. So I had doubts on, oh, but can I really do a day two video recorded on the day one already? Of course I can. There are no rules, but rules or principles are good for discipline. And discipline is, I think, my key to to practice, to show up. This, with this head, I have to show up tomorrow still. But I felt the urge to go into this creation while it lasts. Because I know that inspiration will disappear and I need to write this thing down now and I need to do this thing now because Tomorrow maybe I have something else to do and the inspiration is gone, so I follow this bliss. So my invitation to you is also to follow the bliss. Maybe your hour today of your work, your dedicated artist practiced work, during that hour maybe you get an inspiration to do something else. Stay. Do that hour, even if it's 15 minutes, 15 minutes, 15 minutes. I still did the hour of writing and after I could do this I can share this thing that I wanted to share with you that is coming now because since I'm a writer I need to practice writing I am reading writers I'm studying writing I am studying literature from other writers that's how I learn how to write to read and I study the works of great artists. And today, I was connecting to the sad, my kids, the sad, the sad, who was born on the same day as I was born. So I have some kind of weird spiritual connection. I didn't know that until this day, that because I, I have been looking for some some connections to tell my story. Who else is born on the same day? Anyways, but years ago, but the sad, you know the word saddest, that's from the sad. And the sad created 120 days of Sodom. And s anyway, a lot of sex, violence, bleh, 
like really heavy work but through literature and through the theater these thoughts or taboos could be expressed and I think expression and art saves us from that set I know creation and work saves me from that insanity of being alone, isolated, which happened to the sad when the sad was in jail, imprisoned because of expression. What I want to say is I really want you to express yourself in art, through crafting, because that will keep humanity sane. In fantasy, in art, we can play with those thoughts that are insane and not live them out, because it's safe in art to try, because it's just art. It's just this piece of work that I can look at and say, hey, that's gross or weird or... Wow, how can a person do like that? You know, creating stories of crime and punishment by Dostoevsky about this murder committed by this person and reading this work is making me think what is right and what is wrong and also seeing that this murder, this crime that the Raskolnikov made was was it sane or was it insane, was it good or was it bad and I can actually think through that action not committing the crime myself thanks to that piece of work I know what's right and wrong and in a world where right now I am experiencing a threat against the freedom of expression, art can save us. That's why I have to keep on creating. So the task today, day two, is put that hour in to your expression. Whatever that is, feel the bliss, play. What, what play, like, like, just try something and if you don't know what it is, well, what do you long for? What do you wish you, you do? What do you long, to, what, what do you, what is your, what do you wish for yourself to do? What kind of an artist person do you want to be? Do you want to be a writer, painter? Do you want to be an actor? Act out? Do you want to be a dancer? Dance? And if you want to but don't know how well, then look for someone who knows and see who... Oh, that's a move. I'm gonna try that move. I'm gonna try writing that word down. Study. Study other artists and share in the comments below one artist maybe that you like and then if someone doesn't know any artist then someone else will get your inspiration this is a long clip it was supposed to be one minute but uh, you know shit happens and uh, something else happened see you tomorrow mm. I was almost about to say sorry for taking up so much time, but no, enough with sorries. This is it now. I have to stop say I'm sorry and just be like, fuck you, this is my space. <laughs>